Hey everyone, this is Ms. Moffat from Across the Litiverse. I thought I'd drop in with a mission update since I've gone AWOL again. As you can probably hear, I've got a mighty special cold with me at the moment. Earned through countless hours spent at airports and at convention centers across Canada over the past month. <coughs> That's why I've got the tea handy. For new recruits to the Litiverse, I work at a comic book store, and I make the rounds as the resident anime girl at a string of national conventions. Let me consult my schedule. Wait, I think I have my badges too here. Hold on. So we left for Vancouver on April 17th and worked Vancouver Fan Expo that weekend. I came down with what I think was a flu on the Saturday. It was also the first sick day I've taken since working for the store, and I've been working there for about two years now. Then we flew to Calgary on April 21st for Calgary Expo, who has by far the biggest badge of any convention I've worked. We even got an extra, extra day to set up, which is pretty sweet. Then we flew to Regina on May 1st for Regina Fan Expo, and I can now say I've been to Saskatchewan. Then we flew home on May 5th and drove to Ottawa Comic Con on... May 8th, Ottawa Comic Con. We also got wicked screwed for the Ottawa show because our skids didn't arrive until the Friday night. Did I mention the show opened on Friday afternoon? And we set up until two in the morning. I like to think I'm a Petri dish for Canadian germs at this point. And coming up this weekend is the purely insane, shiny, and fantastic Anime North. AKA, I will be in my element at long last. I am excited. And also hoping I will no longer be coughing by the time I hit the sales floor. Oh yeah. Needless to say, I haven't done a great deal of reading in the last little while. Also, I discovered Supernatural late last year, and as I film this, I'm halfway through season nine, and I'm sad there's gonna be no new content for a long, long, long time. Supernatural robbed me of my life, but it's so fantastic. I regret nothing. On a bookish note, I thought I would share what I'm reading right now just to tide me over until I can film some proper reviews. So here they be. First up is Aurora Rama by Jean-Christophe Valta. Two words, guys. Arctic steampunk. I first read this book in either 2010 or 2011, and I remember really liking the world that Velta laid out. And I remember wishing that there was going to be a series of books that came out just so he could explore more of New Venice. And then I found out this is going to be a trilogy, and I already bought book two, but I thought I should go back and read book one on the manga front. Whispered Words by Takashi Ikeda. This is a slice of life Yuri series that I originally watched as an anime, and I was super excited when I saw this solicited in a diamond catalog a few months ago. This story is painfully adorable and explores just that really crushing, unrequited first love that I'm sure a lot of people can probably relate to. And it does so in just a really funny, really horribly awkward way that is just very refreshing. And on the comic book front, Planetary by Warren Ellis and John Cassidy. I've actually finished this book, so this is probably going to be one of the first reviews I do. I read Planetary in this very daunting omnibus format, condensed review. Freaking fantastic. I have a soft spot for science fiction, particularly hard sci-fi, and this just delivered beyond what I imagined. And I'm sure my co-workers will be very glad to hear that. So that's the current word from the Litiverse, and you can expect some reviews in the upcoming weeks. Signing off! Yeah. <laughs>